Page 35, Lullaby, or an intermezzo by Brahms. You can look up intermezzo, it's a type of piece of music. It's, it's like a lullaby, it's a, just a gentle piece. You can go to sleep to something like this. This is not the famous lullaby melody Brahms wrote. This is a different lullaby, but it's okay. It's like a cradle song. It's, it's a bare sous. It's a lullaby. It's a nocturne. It's gentle, sweet. It's not a drinking song. Three, four time, one sharp, key of G major. Make sure you can do the G major scale. Hmm. Talk about one hand at a time here. It has a pickup beat. We're coming in on beat three. Second finger in the right hand. And then here. Don't forget the F sharp. It's three, one, two, three, one, two, and then the left hand takes over. The right hand comes back in at the end of the line. One and two and three and one and two and And then the left hand does some more, and that's really what it is. Until you get to the bottom, the last couple measures, you're here, rest, and then a two on, on a CD, and then bring the thumb down. Here. You're not changing position, you're just moving the thumb. Okay, that's fine. Left hand, starting out with five on the G and three, and so you're in this position. So here, got it half note, three counts, and then the next measure is one and two and three. And then the right hand takes over, second line here, and second measure, now it's C sharp. And the next measure is C natural. They don't need the natural sign. It'd be a natural anyway. They're being nice to you. It's a C. And then here. Go down to the last line here. And then eighth notes, three and. Three and one and two. It's the left hand. So make sure you can get each hand by itself good. Then put them together. Slowly. When you play that half note D, Lift up that right hand, uh, the left hand, because that's a rest. It's important. One and two and. and connect this. This whole thing is melody. It's got to sound like one hand played the whole thing. So you have to experiment with balancing the hands so it sounds like one hand played it all. Two. They didn't put in any phrasing here, but I'm telling you, this ends a phrase, lift up, before, a little silence before you play the D, don't connect them, and so forth, and otherwise you play them pretty much legato. That square line they have here at the beginning of this, that's simply pointing out a G major scale. That has nothing to do with the music, it's just that little something extra the author of the book is stuck in there. Don't let it confuse you, it doesn't mean anything. It's just pointing out from here, all these notes, is a G major scale. That's all. It's kind of ugly, that's like, oh wow, what's that mean? It doesn't mean anything really, it's just there. Not a lot of articulation going on, it's all connected. I told you to lift up between uh, in the last measure of the second line, lift up between the half note and the quarter note, because it's a new phrase. So other than that, you connect everything. Okay. Dynamics, well, they only give you one. That's sort of moderately soft, medium soft, sort of soft. you have to decide what that is. For the speed, it's Andante Moderato. Well, now that we're mixing them up, Andante is a nice stroll speed. Moderato is a moderate speed. It's more like a, a power waltz or walk. Not a speed walk, but a, it's when you're walking and you you know where you're going, but you're not in a hurry. It's a, it's a walk. Well, Andante, you just kind of slow that down a little bit. Somewhere, it's a range. It's, it's felt. I can't tell you this is it. I can't give you a metronome marking and say this is it, because it isn't. It's, what do you think? You can find recordings of this. Look it up. Opus 117, number one by Brahms. It's not a piano piece, but it's all right. You, get, you can hear the melody in here. You can, hear the, you can hear how the ensemble plays it.
opinion of it. You can go a little faster or a little slower. I wouldn't go much faster than that, but a little slower if you wanted. Let's play it together very slowly to double check the notes. And since it's a pickup beat, I'm only going to give us two beats and then we'll start. I'm going to go, ready, go, and we go. So, here we go. Ready and go, and one. 